There are not many stores where you can buy a flat screen TV, sneakers, tonight's dinner, and diapers in the same store, also at a low price every day. Walmart has a way of working their business in a way where they can give you a one stop store and it'd be very cheap. And that's why in today's video, we will be telling you guys their story. The store chain began in 1950 when businessman Sam Walton purchased a store from Luthery Harrison in Bentonville, Arkansas, and opened Walton's 5 and 10. The Walmart chain proper was founded in 1962 with a single store in Rogers, expanding outside Arkansas by 1968, ultimately operating a store in every state of the United States, plus its first stores in Canada by 1995. The expansion was largely fueled by new store construction, although the chain's more value and Kuhn's Big K were also acquired. The company introduced its warehouse club chain Sam's Club 1983. By the second decade of the 21st century, the chain had grown to over 11,000 stores in 27 countries. Walton believed that he would be successful if he sold his items at a low price. Many thought that this idea would never follow through. The aspirations of this company became greater than he expected. He had a way of speaking that made the associates want to expand. And as a result, Walmart is worth today for 129 billions. Based on Walmart's revenue and profits from the last three years, Walmart operates more than 10,500 stores and clubs under 46 banners in 24 countries and e commerce websites. As of the end of 2022, they employed approximately 2.3 million associates worldwide, with approximately 1.7 million associates in the US. Walton died on Sunday, April 5, 1992, by a type of blood cancer. At the time of his death, he was worth $8.6 billion. The news of his death was relayed by satellite while 1,960 Walmart stores. At the time, his company employed 380,000 people. The Walton family is still the major shareholder of Walmart. The children of Walton own about half of all Walmart shares. According to official company documents, the Walton family owns just under half of the retail giant founded by Sam. Walton and the family has a combined net worth of almost $200 billion, according to the Bloomberg Billionaires Index. And this was one more video about success stories from For Focus Digital. If you want success, subscribe and give us a like and if you don't want tea, it's okay. Probably you will work for one of our subscribers. See you in the next video.